succulent honey glazed ham, juicy bacon, stew pork, and other delectable pork products synonymous with the festive season will come at a higher price, effective December 15, 2022. The announcement was made on Thursday via a statement from the St. Lucia Pig Farmers Cooperative Society Limited. It was really, really, it was high time that we got an increase, that we got an increase because it, it, the farmers are just not making any money, not making any profit. So it's a welcomed, a welcomed move for the farmers. They welcome that move. Well, well it was, it, it's a welcome one because it, it had to be done. If it wasn't done, um, then what you'd have is the actual um, destruction of the entire sector. President of the St. Lucia Pig Farmers Society Limited, Carl Daniel, says fervent discussions with the relevant authorities, including the Ministry of Commerce and Ministry of Agriculture, resulted in a plan of action that included an increase in price of the meat products. This is also in keeping with broader measures to save an ailing local pork industry. The price increase will give us uh, some sort of relief, and then we've got to engage in other aspects in terms of reducing the cost of production um, by, by um, one of the plans we have is to import um, a, a feed for our farmers so that they, we can reduce the markup on, on, on feed, you know, and so it is just the start of things to come. We, there are many, many more things that we have to do in order to improve the, um, the success of farmers. In a phone interview with News Force, Daniel paints the picture of a sector on the brink of collapse. Consumers now will bear the price increase on both wholesale dressed wheat and live weight pork products. So will there be enough pork available this Christmas? Well, this price increase has done, at least it has given hope. So that at least um, farmers will be able to... to, to um, to continue and then expand and then in the process for us to do the other things that are required to bring down to be able to import the animal feed so that we can make it available to the farmers at a reduced cost mm -hmm. um, and other things like like processing we, at some point we have to go into processing so that we can pursue value added to the products to the to the pork that we produce so they, so it's it's work in progress but it's a very good start that will at least keep farmers in production. The goal right now is the survival of St. Lucia's pork industry. The Pig Farmers Society Limited is calling for support from the pork consuming public to ensure the livelihoods of the farmers island wide are secured. Solaj Alfred, HDS News Force.